Guardian, The Daily Telegraph, The New York Daily, Vulture, and MSNBC. I, I noticed that uh, on Twitter, Lindy ran a campaign for the social media awards saying, vote for me and maybe I'll get to party with Jane Fonda. <laughs> Actually, before you all got here, we kind of did party downstairs. <laughs> Lindy referred to me as an old school badass Jane Fonda. But Lindy, from one badass feminist to another, I'm very pleased to congratulate you as the winner of the 2013 Media, Women's Media Center Social Media Award. Please welcome Lindy <laughs> Thanks, Jane Fonda. This is Jane Fonda talking to me. Um, what is it, Tuesdays? You know. Oh, I got a special jewel. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I love Jane Fonda so much. The other day he showed a clip from coming home, I started crying. It's fine. Um, Jane Fonda. <laughs> <laughs> I stood near Sally Field and we both got champagne and I pretended it was normal. It was fine. I pretend like I'm cool but I'm this complete buzzing all the time everywhere I go that's not Seattle. So anyway, I want to say thank you. I can't, I don't have words to thank of the women's, the women's media center. Jane Fonda. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, so I want to say that when I first found out that I won this award, my uh, I hope this isn't uncouth, but my immediate reaction was uh, rage because I, I was like, did no one read the list of the people? Because the, the, the real honor for me is just to be on a list with those other women's names. <laughs> Not as valid 
as anyone else in the world just because you're not in print media or arguing on cable news or whatever it is, is deemed valid. Uh, don't listen to those people because all of the women on the social media nominees list with me have changed my life completely and the way that I think about the world and the way that I check myself and my assumptions and it is incredibly inspiring and completely invaluable and that's the future and I'm totally proud to be a part of it. Thank you so much. Yeah!